Chapter 15, uh, Chemical Equilibrium, and I'm doing these, uh, this chapter out of order for my own personal reasons. Chapter 15 is about equilibrium. Um, in, in a chemical reaction, what we have is a dynamic equilibrium. We have two opposing processes that occur at the same rate but they oppose each other. And this is a lot like a freeway with traffic moving in opposite directions. We have cars going north and cars coming south. And if they're coming and going at the same rate, if you count the number of cars at this end and at this end, they're going to be the same number of cars, but they're going to be different cars because there's this motion. So we have two opposing things, cars going north, cars coming south. Same rate, but opposite direction. So there's a lot of change happening, and yet overall, everything's the same. And so it's kind of a, it, it seems kind of contradictory. Another analogy I like is a busy airport. So take a busy airport and count the number of people in the airport at 10 o'clock in the morning and count the number of people at the airport at maybe 2 o'clock in the afternoon. The number of people there is probably the same, but they probably are not all the same people because there were airplanes coming and bringing people in and there are airplanes leaving and taking people away. So the actual people are changing, but the number of them is relatively constant. That's the idea of a dynamic equilibrium. <clears throat>